Hey everybody, it's Chris Symmetric from TDW. First of all, I haven't forgot about you. I've been dealing with some medical issues and dealing, getting through the winter months here in upstate New York and haven't been able to post anything new in a while. Um, but I still, you know, have been doing lots of woodworking, but still being very creative, doing a lot more painting and drawing. But anyways, more on that to come. Right now, I'm excited and happy. I've been waiting for a long time and researching 12 inch disc sanders. Uh, I've seen them in fellow uh, YouTube woodworker uh, videos and it seems to be a staple for a lot of people. And everything that I'm hearing and everything that I'm seeing seems like the best bang for the buck is the old Harbor Freight 12 inch disc sander. Now it really runs for about 170 normally which, comparatively speaking, for a Grizzly or a Delta, that would you know, be 250 to 300. Um, so this is decent, and it gets really good reviews. It's probably one of the best reviewed review Harbor Freight's website. So anyways, let's do an unboxing and set up and use and get a feel for this thing. And i got to tell you, it is heavy. This box was 90 pounds or so, so I needed some help out oh, into, the, uh, into the shop with it. So... Uh, Anyways, let's uh, go ahead and I'll show you my new 12 inch disc sander that I've been pumped about getting. Now, I did want to say that I do have the, call it the insider track, which just means that you don't pay the full rate. I paid $119 for this because I have the Harbor Freight yearly insider track discount card. So for $120 bucks, for something that's you know more than double that in some places, I'm, I'm very happy. But we'll see how it goes. Let's get it all set up. All right, so I got everything down into the basement, and um, you know I'm not really into unboxing videos, so I'm going to spare you all of the details. But I thought maybe what I would do is grab my tools and throw on my GoPro and shoot a video of me taking apart the uh, the 12-inch disc sander from Harper Freight. So let's uh, let's give it a whirl and we can uh, see what it looks like in the box here. All right, I'm making uh, short work of the straps here and opening it up, I like to use a technique in which instead of me trying to lift this heavy item out is I just cut the, uh, the box wide open and slide that bad boy right out. Well, I was really impressed at how complete this was, I mean, there was nothing I needed to do other than level the uh, outfeed table, so I threw it on my chair and I slid it into the other room. Well, you know, the job couldn't have been any easier. Basically, once I got it to the bench, and again, it is a pretty heavy unit, um, all I needed to do was to loosen up the knob on the side and get everything to 90 degrees. Once I verified that, I think it was about ready to run my first test, but Pretty simple. Plug it in and go. All right. First powering on. Let's see how it goes. Oh, she's really quiet. You can hear me pretty well. Pretty slick. Let's try some hard wood. Now I got a six inch belt with a four inch disc sander, but one of the problems is you only get a very small little area to work on. When you have a four inch disc, you're looking at maybe okay. two inches of usable space. I mean, because you're cutting on the down, and when I come over to this, you know, I got a good five, six inches of uh, workable area. <laughs> So all in all, so far it's pretty good. Now, six months from now, I'll do another review, but I'm very happy. There's so many projects I keep putting it off and putting it off getting it, and I didn't really want to spend, you know, $300 on a uh, disc sander, but, uh, but this should work out fine, and uh, I hope you appreciate the review I did, and if you have any experience with uh, a 12-inch disc sander for woodworking, uh, you know, throw some comments down below. 
appreciate uh, you guys being patient. And this is Chris from TDW Woodwork. We'll see you on the flip side.